everyone, Phil from Tech for Techs. Today we're going to be looking at this Acasa fan frame, which is RGB, or should I say addressable RGB. And the idea is, is you basically attach it to a fan to make it look like it's an RGB fan. So it saves you going out, getting a brand new RGB fan, uh, when you can just add this to it and make it look like it's an RGB fan and keep the performance of the fan you already have. Here's a quick message from our sponsor. Okay, let's get down to basics with this. What it is, is a piece of plastic with lights all the way around uh, the inner circle. And when you've got it connected to your motherboard, it lights up. But what you do is actually attach it to a fan, so it lights up your fan. So if you've got any fans that have not got RGB on them, and you want to light them up, you can do this. If the fan is on the front of your case, you would ideally position the fan frame uh, so it's pointing to the front of your case so it'll be in front of the actual fan itself so you can see through the actual window on the front of your case if it has one the actual led lights if you've got it on the back or the top of your case a fan and you're attaching it you would attach it to the side what's pointing inwards of your case so it would light up the inside of your case obviously you could do whichever you wanted if you really wanted to but that would be the ideal situation Okay, let's have a quick look at the actual packaging itself. It's pretty straightforward. It says addressable RGB LED fan frame. Some places call this digital. Uh, we're going to call it addressable for now. Uh, the back of the box is pretty straightforward. It shows you how to connect it to the actual motherboard itself. It does have an adapter in the box, which will fit other types. Um, so it should be pretty easy to fit to uh, most, if not all, of the high-end motherboards out there what support addressable slash digital RGB connections. That includes top-end or Gigabytes, uh, MSI, ASRock, uh, and uh, Asus boards. Setting it up was extremely easy. You just take the four screws it comes with and screw it into the front of the fan. Or if you want it in the back of the fan, it does come with some extra long screws which will screw through your chassis, then the, then the frame, and then your fan. Uh, so it's all in one place. And then you just hook up to your ARGB or digital RGB motherboard or controller connection. I really like the idea of this kit because you have, if you have a high performance fan, a lot of them don't come with RGB. And let's just say you want a high performance fan and RGB, you may struggle to find one. But this way you can pick the exact fan you want and attach the RGB yourself. So it'll, you get the best of both worlds. Um, let's have a quick look at the pros of this. Um, the most standout point was it was easy to install, very easy. Four screws and then plug into the motherboard. That's it. Obviously you control the lights with your motherboard or your controller RGB software. Uh, the pros are it's easy to install, good value for money, works as it should, everything you need is included and the packaging looks um, great. Uh, the only drawback was the cable length for the RGB connector could be a little bit longer to help with routing it around the back of the case. Due to everything we've said we've awarded this our Platinum Award. If you like this review, please feel free to like, subscribe or share this review. There is a link in the description which will take you to our website with even more information on this. But feel free to watch uh, the effects going off on the lights just after this.